the Indian Army. Intelligence reports said that the Chinese embassy in Kathmandu has asked the China Study Centre, the NGO, to find out why people of Nepal are joining the Indian Army and uh, what was the socio-economic impact of that in Nepal. A missed confrontation with India, of course, the de-escalation process uh, is taking place and uh, it is being resolved through a dialogue. Uh, China now trying to meddle in Nepal's affairs. Let's go across to Shinjo, our national affairs editor, joining us on the broadcast. The Gorkha Regiment in the Indian Army is a pillar of strength and security of the Indian Army. And China all of a sudden is now interested in knowing why is it that Nepalese nationals join the Indian Army? Yes, the first and most important question to ask is why is China interested? Because what we are hearing, according to our intelligence reports, is that the Chinese embassy in Kathmandu has asked one of their NGOs, uh, an NGO they paid 8 lakhs, uh, the China Study Center to find out, number one, why the people of Nepal are joining the Indian Army. And secondly, what is the social economic impact of that in Nepal? Obviously, the Gurkha soldiers send money home and all that. And they retire, they come back with uh, the ethos of the Gurkha regiment. Now, the Indian Army has 40, about 40 battalions. Uh, of Gurkha soldiers. Uh, not all of them are from Nepal. Some are obviously mm. Gurkhas who are uh, taken in from India. Right. But the question, why is Nepal interested? Uh, why is China interested? Uh, why does China want to know about the Gurkha regiments of the Indian Army? Mm. And why is the Chinese uh, uh, embassy in Kathmandu so keen to pay 8 lakh to a uh, uh, NGO? Uh, to actually gather all this information. Hmm. Right, you know, initially the Gurkha regiment, of course, was created uh, when in the British Army. Since then, the tradition carries on. A little bit of Google search would help China, uh, you know, uh, understand the kind of relationship India and Nepal share. Yes, absolutely. And there will be further talks uh, in a, within a week or so. But historically, for years and years and decades, uh, the Gurkha Regiment after independence uh, stayed with the Indian Army. Hmm. A few, uh, a, a small section went back to the British Army. Hmm. But even then, regardless of that, you are looking at uh, 40 battalions of Gurkha soldiers. Hmm. That's a lot of troops. You know, each battalion has approximately a thousand soldiers. Hmm. Now, after all these years, suddenly China has a bright idea. Let's find out what the socio-economic impact is. Of course, there is no socio-economic China, impact. That, yes, that China is trying to cash in on the situation of uh, uh, the, the border dispute, the newly uh, uh, developed border dispute after Nepal passed that map in Parliament. And China is trying to cash in on that particular uh, situation at this point in time. Thank you very much, Shrinjoy, for joining us with those details. Taking a short break now.